Yo, this is BZ Gador with Men's Health with the king of shoulder exercises. It's called Arnold Presses. Named after the Terminator himself, Arnold Schwarzenegger, one of the best bodybuilders of all time. He popularized this exercise. It adds a rotation to a classic shoulder press to get all three heads, anterior, lateral, and posterior of the deltoids working. So it is a one fell swoop shoulder exercise. You want to do it first? Let's do it traditionally. Grab a pair of dumbbells. I'm going to get the dumbbells placed like this, start palms facing in. I'm going to squeeze my glutes, rib shoulders down, abs tight, and I'm going to focus on as I press. Turn out, keep the shoulders down, and get full extension at the top. Lower in control and just reverse the pattern. When you come back in, bring the elbows tight to your ribs and make yourself into a nice plank position. We want to make sure we do the move without hyperextending the back at the top. And also, you want to get full range of motion. Don't stop short here. Sometimes it's good if you want to get constant tension on the shoulders, but our gold standard is full range of motion, full extension of the arms, and get this puppy working. Now, I can go between the simultaneous pattern. I can also alternate arms, which will allow me to get a little rest between sides, keep the intensity higher, and also extend the duration of the set. Both options are great, so use them in your training. Another option, and the interesting thing about this is, the way to press a kettlebell is actually an Arnold press inherently. You have to add the rotation. So what you'll do is, you'll get the kettlebell into the rack position, starts right here, handle thumb right by the sternum area, and I'm going to just rotate, fully extend and press, bring it down. The one arm version is amazing, why? Because the glutes have to work really hard to stabilize quickly the lateral hip, and the obliques and core working hard to fight the tilting, turning forces of the asymmetrical load. So this is a phenomenal option to incorporate as well. You can mix between level changes as well, doing them standing, seated, or tall kneel position, or split kneel. Again, there's some mobility benefits from the split kneel. The tall kneel is gonna really challenge your core muscles. So mix in both options, and not just eight to 12 reps. I know bodybuilding will tell you that, but new science really shows to us that you wanna use a variety of loads for low, medium, and high repetitions to fully maximize muscle growth. So do it today, and make sure as we're doing it, Arnold Presses. Bye.